this is a stalling on Israel's side, and it's something they've been doing since this case started in 1972. And also it's because I think they postponed because of the pol public and global uprising against this effort of forced eviction. Um, but the other side of the coin is I'm kind of, you know, it buys me some time in my house if it's another 30 days, but it's, this is not a life for anybody to live, to count their to count their life and their house with days and see how many times the court cases are gonna be postponed. Today, we have seven people, my father, my mother, my twin sister, my younger brother and my younger sister and myself at the house. You know, I grew up there, I had my coming of age there. I learned and unlearned in that house. I think what makes our house unique is the jasmine trees in it. Um, the rose bushes in it. What's so important about Sheikh Jarrah is that it's happening in broad daylight and it's happening um, with people finally watching it and finally paying attention to what's going on. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.